It's a tool. The mirror can be your friend. History can be your friend. Mirror can be your enemy. History can be your enemy. Okay. It's why you want to know history. If you want to dance and want to understand more about dancing, history is great because people have been dancing for a long time. If you want a reason to not dance, sometime in history, somebody <laughs> did not dance. And you will find a reason to not dance. You understand? No. There are a lot of people. Now, okay, a little Byron history. Um, I was not always dancing for a living. I, in my last job, was the chief technical officer of a trade firm. I wore a suit every day, even in the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> so my job was to understand technology, and society, and make it all blend. I love the house scene. I love what it can do for people. I love it so much that for all the things I was doing before, I still found this to be more special inside. So before, I made a whole lot of money. So what? I could buy very expensive scotch. It'd make me happy. It's true. Uh, I could get this really cool computer, and then I could buy, guess what? I could buy the next one. Oh my god, and guess what? I could buy the next one. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't doing it for me. You know? After a while, I just ran out of stuff. And it's just, what I needed was more people stuff. More, like, this stuff. Because I could never buy it. And then I just needed more time to be with more people. And what I was doing before did not allow me more time. So, what do you need to have a house dance community? People. Uh, music. Yeah, that's it. History. And again, really simple. A space like this, okay, 1970. One man understands sound, okay? But he he's, he's very like, woo, about sound. Like, oh my God, I have this idea. I can make sound, sound, so good. Uh, okay. <laughs> No, you don't understand. Listen. The beginning of sound, I need to make it really nice so at the speaker, it sounds better. Just make it louder, right? No! He goes to his home and he makes a record player. Okay? But this is not like this. It's Maybe 1,000 kilograms. <laughs> heavy. Okay. Very, very heavy. Why? Because before, you know, the record is like this. You're playing the music, and maybe it's, you know. But he loves, 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 loves music. So he said, no, 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 I can't have the, I must make it strong. Okay. Then the needle. Is made of, you know, sword. It's made of this, this, this style. It's made with this technique. So that he gets them from outside. It's really crazy for this, right? And it's 1970. So, no Amazon.com. He's. <laughs> he gets these materials, and he, he he has he has what they call a loft. Okay, a loft is a, a apartment or a house with no walls to separate. 
So you see here, there's, there's no, there's no like, there's no, no, no beams. There's, it's just open, right? Th this room is open. His apartment is like this, open. Right? So it's good for the, the sound. Then he makes the speakers. Puts them in the wall. Runs his own wire. And then he says to people who, who are like, who believe in what he's saying, hey, come to my house. Uh, okay. And they're coming, and these people, now it's 1970, okay? In the 60s, people were like, peace, man, peace, man. <laughs> in the 70s, there's some, some things going on in the US and in New York. There's a lot of people trying to get a face. Like, women want to be, like, equal. And black and Spanish and white and uh, they want to be like, like I, I was somebody too. You know, everybody wants to have a, a face. And gay and straight, I, I'm a person too. In many other places, they're like, no, 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 no. But in this place, in this loft, come in. I don't care what you look like. I don't care your age. I don't care if you like this one or that one. If this is okay, come. Okay. So they come in, but what happens is like a miracle. They hear a sound like nobody else. And they're like, woohoo! You know? The sound he made, no one could make again until the 90s. You understand? It just couldn't. <laughs> they tried. They had all the cool stuff. Casio. But they couldn't make the sound. Not like this. Most club systems are based on this idea. Okay. So all these people. Who are these people? Remember, uh... Remember my name? Fame! I'm gonna leave forever. <laughs> If you see like the Broadway or the movies or whatever, they're like, Woo! Look, that's it. They're coming from LaGuardia High School. They're coming from Alvin Ailey. They're coming from everywhere. They're coming from Brooklyn and from Manhattan. There's gangsters and they're drug addicts and they're rich people and they're, and you know what? They come in, no one cares. Now, if you want it to be cool, there, this goes, there's other stuff, right? Because in New York, there's so much stuff all the time. So if you want to be like, yo, I'm cool, check out my stuff, yeah. You go through the other place. <laughs> <laughs> but you're going to come into a house with all kinds of people, and it's 1970s, so they're doing all kinds of stuff. And it's all good? Yeah. So they come together, okay? This is important to house dance because Sometimes when you go to a house club, the feeling is different. It's like, it always seems to be people are having some kind of fun. The music seems, the music has some kind of fun inside. And most people enjoy house for this reason. This idea starts from this time. You understand? So, I say the history helps you because, well, I'm not in New York, so what? One of the original clubs is this, and some people who like music. All right. When we did the floor stuff, and we were playing, we are doing this, we are sharing this moment, this music was so rich, and in the 70s, people were looking for spiritual, they wanted to get their spirit. Right? This was the place for that. And they could dance for how, however long. And they could just let it go, let it so the sensual energy, this, this rich, beautiful energy, is a mix of men and women, young and old, and all races. My dance has to respect you. My dance has to respect you. Your dance gives me, and I give to you, and you give to him, and you can. This is happening. <laughs> they don't know what is happening to them, okay? They're just coming, and they love it so much, and they just coming together, coming together. There's no, there's no internet. There's no YouTube. 
So you go home, right? You can't, there's no cell phones. And you're that person in your neighborhood going, oh my God, I went to this great party. Really? So, uh, hey, chicks were hot? No, it wasn't like that, man. It was, it was great, like the music, it, it, ah! Uh, listen, just come! I don't want to, come! And that person has to come all the way to this house. And then they see it and feel it. And they lose it. Woo! Okay? And this is the only way to, to, to experience it, is to go. Okay? 